appear to be heading into some kind of fantasy land here. Why on earth is the Prime Minister proposing to spend £1.3 billion on a top-down reorganisation that wasn't in his manifesto, teachers don't want it, parents don't want it, governors don't want it, head teachers don't want it, even his own MPs and councillors don't want it. Can't he just think again and support schools and education, not force this on them? Well, let me answer his question very directly about spending, because we have, of course, protected, we have protected spending per pupil all the way through the last Parliament and all the way through this Parliament, and we're spending £7 billion on more school places to make up for the woeful lack of action under the last Labour government. That is the truth on spending. Now, he talks about fantasy land. I think it's the Labour Party that this week entered fantasy land when they are now abandoning Trident in Scotland. They've selected someone who sits on platforms with extremists in London and they've now decided, when I read, when I read they were going to ban McDonnell from the party conference, I thought it was the first sensible decision they've made. But it turns out it wasn't the job destroyer they wanted to keep away from their conference. It was one of Britain's biggest employers. No wonder, no wonder Labour MPs are in despair. Frankly, I'm loving it. Yeah.